Hi, welcome to Action Month. Let's kick things off by talking muscle flares. Now a basic muzzle flare effect can be done in five easy steps. Step one, shoot your footage. Try to emulate the kickback that your weapon would have in real life. Your performance may vary depending on the story you're trying to tell, but you should always illustrate the precise moment of gunfire clearly and intently. This will make editing easier and even enhance the quality of the effect. Step two, find your flare. Simply put muzzle flare into your search engine. It's ideal to find a flash that's set against a black background. I'll explain why in a bit. Once you find a flare that you like, just save it to your computer. Step 3. Import your files into your editing suite. The footage from before should be on the bottom layer, with the flash on top. Shorten the flash to only one or two frames. Line up the muzzle flare with the precise moment that the weapon goes off. You'll more than likely have to zoom all the way in on the timeline to line it up just right. Then simply adjust the scale and position of the flare to the tip of the barrel. Step 4. Now that you've got everything in the editor, it's time to finalize the muzzle flare. First and foremost, assuming you got an image that had a black background, you'll have to apply a luma key. A luma key will key out all of the black and isolate the flare. You may consider adding a slight blur to the flare so it'll appear smoother in the shot. If you opted for two frames, adjust the opacity so that the second frame is significantly more transparent than the first. Step 5. Find a fitting sound effect from a sound library online and lay it underneath your footage. After that, you're finished. Hey guys, I hope you found this video useful. You can expect a more uh, advanced muzzle flare tips video sometime in the future. Feel free to like and maybe subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Feel free to check out the second channel as well. And if you'd like to stay completely up to date on what's coming out for Action Month, I suggest checking out my blog, lanuski.blogspot.com. I've got my own feature page for Action Month where everything related to this event will be gathered into one spot, including movie reviews and articles and other things about action movies and stuff that I recommend. But uh, yeah, I'll see you again in the very near future with another video that's hopefully a lot more action-packed than this one was. Have a good day.